What is good guys? In this video, I want to share with you how to absolutely obliterate the cover six for a one play touchdown in Madden 22. What's going on guys? My name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is focusing in on helping people become the best Madden player they can possibly become. So if you're looking to get better at this game, I just want to encourage you to click the subscribe button down below. It's free to subscribe to the channel and it just allows you to stay up to date with the latest tips and strategies right here on the channel. Now guys, we're going to show you in this video how to bomb cover six for a one play touchdown out of my shotgun bunch offensive guide. If you've not already gotten the gun bunch guide that I released earlier in the year, this is the best offense in Madden 22. It's the offense that every single pro player is running in tournaments because it is literally lethal and almost impossible to defend and consistently stop. So if you want to start putting up 50 points a game, bombing coverages over the top for one play scores, I'd encourage you to get the full version of the Seattle Seahawks offensive guide um, out of the gun bunch. That's going to be in the description of this video. Guys, we've been updating this guide over the course of the first couple of weeks of the game as new patches and new coverages and new concepts are coming out. So you're always going to have the latest and up-to-date, most up-to-date content within this guide and the bombs are going to be very uh, effective against pretty much any coverage in the game. So that being said, guys, I would encourage you to get it. Again, it's just 15 bucks. And we've also been adding in other plays out of Gun Bunch that are really effective also from like the Carolina playbook, the Indianapolis Colts playbook, and the Washington football team playbook. So you wanna get access to all that content. Again, that's available in the description. So the play we're gonna be going over against for bombing cover six is the clear out SEL. And my favorite thing about this is if you get a press coverage against cover six, all you're gonna do is you're gonna put that running back on a table route to the left side. And what you're gonna see here is the square receiver. You're just gonna pass lead him to the left. And, oh, <laughs> I guess I got off to a great start here. Let me show it to you again. If you pass lead him to the left, uh, Brady kind of did not get the ball out there uh, real, real good. But again, if you pass lead this guy um, to the left at a clear out, what you're going to see is right when he starts fading, just passing him to the left, that's what we're looking for. And as you can see, you're able to beat cover six. Now, that's not how you beat it for a one-play score, but this is just something that I like to tell people because this is a really easy way to, to basically manipulate cover six. Just passing him to the left, and there you see you're able to make that catch. Okay? The next way we want to manipulate cover six is to the back side of the formation. So um, to the back side of the formation, all we're going to do is we're going to streak our tight end. And then um, let me just see how this works real quick. But I'm pretty sure that if we just streak our tight end, this is all we need to do. But take a look at this circle receiver, which you'll see here. And I guess they did play it that they played that properly. Um, so if you streak the tight end, and then what you're going to do is you're going to take the R1 and you're going to put them on a smart routed out route. So streak and smart routed out route. Very simple. Um, you don't need Hot Route Master to do this. And what you'll see here is is you will bomb over the top. Uh, either to the tight end or to the other guy. Now, the best way to do this, and this will absolutely kill cover six, whether they put that safety on the right in the deep half or not, um, the best way to do this is to take the R1 and put him on a corner route. Um, this, If you have Hot Route Master or you have Slot Apprentice, um, you can get this corner route out there. Um, there's cards that are going to be coming out that are going to have this. But what you'll see is the circle receiver will absolutely just bomb cover six over the top for a one-play touchdown every single time. And the cool part about this is very, very consistent from this formation. Um, it, it really is very simple um, to beat this over the top. Again, I would double team here so I could roll out a little bit. But what you'll see is with a corner route and a streak to that tight end, that's really the formula. And what you'll see is circle is going to kill match coverage over the top for a one-play score. And it's really not even close. Okay? I wanted to give you another way that you could do this that does not require uh, Hot Route Master. And then we're going to come back out of this and come back out in another play that I really like against this uh, specific defense of the cover six. Um, and that is the play Bench Pivot. Now, Bench Pivot is really good because the tight end really is going to glitch out uh, a lot of what the defense is going to do. So let me first show you kind of a base setup of Bench Pivot. And what you'll see is that the... Um, you know, the, the defense covers the base setup fairly well. As you can see right there, it, it covers it fairly well. But what you can do is you go to cover six and you streak the R1 receiver. Uh, or I'm sorry, not the R1 receiver, but the circle receiver. And all you're going to do is you're just going to snap the ball, you're going to get this misalignment, and you're going to lob it over the top for a one-play score. This is very similar to the way the play Flood worked last year 
Um, this is a great cover four uh, quarters beater. It's a great cover three beater. Um, it's a great everything beater this year, man. Just zig the R1, streak the circle receiver. You keep that same high-low concept, but what you also gain by this is an absolute bomb against cover four uh, or cover six. Cover six being, in my opinion, the harder coverage of the two to bomb this year. Um, this is a really, really good concept. So if you're getting a lot of cover six, to me, this is the easiest way. All you're doing is you're zigging R1, streaking circle, and at the snap of the ball, what you'll see is that the circle receiver will just basically get an instant separation, and it's a one-play score every single time against this coverage. So that is how you bomb the cover six. I think you're going to start seeing players go to cover six. Cover six is going to be on the rise because cover six does a really good job of stopping two things. It does a good job of stopping uh, corner routes, and it does a really good job of stopping post routes. This is a way around that. A very good little cover six beater out of the gun bunch. If you want to get my full gun bunch offense, again, it's in the description. You just click that link down there below. It'll take you to the website. You'll be able to get the whole entire system for just 15 bucks. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you want to get that Seattle gun bunch guide, uh, it's in the description. Just click that link for just 15 bucks.